Greetings, my name is Velarde. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a reading for the zodiac sign Gemini for the month of December 2020. Now, if you guys haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to my channel. And if you find that this message resonates with you, please leave me a like or a comment. Thank you so much. Greta Gungun, please let me know the messages that you have for the sign Gemini for the month of December 2020. Thank you so much. Share, 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 share. that you currently have for Gemini for the month of December. Thank you so much. What messages do you have for the month of December for Gemini? Okay. Now you guys are refusing to let a relationship go. You're refusing to be. You're refusing to let a relationship go that needs to be let go because you're afraid of the heartbreak. Okay. You guys are afraid of loss of losing this relationship. Okay. Now this person or this relationship, this person is really too young for you and in a way too immature um maybe you like that maybe you like the fact that this person is immature and too young for you but you you low-key regret being with this person but you like this person because this person is pleasing to you aesthetically and pleasing to you in the bedroom but you know you require more from this person okay you require more for this person. You know that this person has fallen in love with you. You don't want to let this person go either. Because you know this it would, hurt, it would hurt this person. You know how much this this person has fallen in love with you. And you low-key have fallen in love with this person, but not deeply. It's really shallow. It's really appeasing to your ego. Okay? And you know you should leave this person alone, like I said. But you like the sex. Okay, and you have an opportunity. You have an opportunity that's coming to you as far as relationship wise, something that's more your speed, but you refuse. Yeah, you refuse to even initiate that relationship or start that relationship because you're too trapped into this young buck right here okay you know this other person that that you have an opportunity to be with is more your speed what you need what you need to settle down with but you're kind of stuck in your way you kind of stuck in what you want okay and so that's leaving you that's leaving you basically stuck okay you won't be able to advance you know spiritually with this with this person with okay and this person that that's more your speed really is your soulmate. So you got this person half ass waiting on you, okay? And that shit ain't cool. At all. You you go to this person to have those adult conversations with, to have those spiritual heart to hearts with, but then you leave them there. You just drain them emotionally and spiritually, and you go back. To this, to this young person that really can't give you what you truly need. All right. What other messages do you have for Gemini's for the month of December? But you gotta quit stringing this little girl along, and this is actually making you a cold-hearted person. Okay. It's really making you a cold-hearted person. Okay. You're really gambling with your love life here. You're gambling with your love. Like you're taking a chance. Like like this person that's your soulmate that you have an opportunity to be with and are more equally yoked with. You're playing with your love like and you're cause you're thinking that this person is gonna wait for you until you decide to be with them. Until you decide to quit playing with this young and dumb person. Okay. 
But you're gonna have to stop that shit. Like, cause you're gonna lose. You're gonna lose this opportunity if you don't do what you should do, okay? And maybe you're scared to fully commit to this person as more your 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 steal of because you're afraid of heartbreak. You're afraid of them breaking your heart because you probably look you feel like you're not worthy for them. So you'd rather be with someone like this young buck, okay, who feels like they need you. Maybe this this person that's your soulmate feels like they don't need you, and that's what scares you, okay? But that's how it is to be with a real person, okay? For more than just looks, for more than just sex. All right, Gemini. Increase support. Your positive focus and willingness to receive have opened your doorway to abundance and help and opportunities, okay? So you even have friends telling you, yo, like, bruh, or yo, sis, like, you need to do what you're supposed to do. Like, you need to use your higher intuition and let this go like why are you just like tripping on this you need to cut this out and go with the one that you're really supposed to be with okay so you got good friends in your ear telling you what you should do it's just you holding your own self back gambling with your love life life lessons you can break free from re reoccurring negative patterns by praying to know the lesson and blessing they contain ashe okay so get up out of this reoccurring, you know, going back and forth in between these two people, okay? Pray for the lesson of what this is, okay? Stop being in confusion and being greedy, you know, having them both low-key because you're playing with three hearts here, okay? Pray for the lesson it contains. Get the lesson that you can from this young one. Get this lesson that you can for yourself and go where you need to go, where your heart truly wants to reside, okay? Not where you're second chakra which is your sacral chakra wants to reside in okay you gotta vibrate higher all right that's what life is about vibrating higher ascending higher okay gemini okay please give me another message that you have for gemini for december 2020 thank you so much You guys are going to have to stop being so guarded and open yourself up to true, real love, okay? You have the opportunity for it, but you're blocking your opportunity by being with this other person that you're just basically using for your own ego. That's not fair to all three of y'all, okay? At all, it's not fair. Wholeness, creation of sacred purpose, divine parents, okay? So you need to become whole. All right. You think having both of these women is balancing you out and making you whole. It's not. You're going to have to be whole within. You have to do the work that you need to do within. OK, learn this lesson. Grow from this and ask yourself, why are you like this? Why you feel like you need to hold on to this person when you have someone that's waiting for you right now to give you everything that you need, that you want, your desire. You're actually dream girl. OK, you can't put two people together. To become the product that you want okay that's just egotistical you can't do that okay you're gonna have to tap in within and become whole within yourself because there's obviously something lacking if you feel you need you need to play with people hearts like this okay gemini that's just the straight up truth about it do the work that you need to do you have the the friends you know that could help you and you have people around you that could help lift you up okay and, the, you know, the most high wants you to learn from this and grow from this, okay? If not, you're just going to keep gambling and you're, you're the one that's going to be hurt. Both of these people will move on and you're going to be stuck like Chuck by the fuck by yourself, okay? All right, Gemini. That is your reading. If you find this message has resonated with you, please leave me a like and a comment. And if you would like a personal reading, please email me at southpalm at gmail.com. All right, Gemini. Peace. Uh -huh.